despite the breakdown of all communications, our staff cameraman was the first on the scene and succeeded in securing these remarkable, though tragic, pictures amid the ruins of the province of Avellino. Only now is the full extent of the disaster which has overtaken southern Italy beginning to be realized. The official casualty list is reported to be 2,142 dead and 4,551 injured. But there is no way in which a check on those missing can be made, for all the public buildings of the towns have been destroyed. Heart-rending scenes are witnessed as the homeless pilgrims wend their way to the great encampments above the devastated towns. Warm weather has made the plight of the distressed population a little less acute, but a terrible task faces the survivors. The city of Melfi was one of the greatest sufferers, being the centre of the first great tremor. It was this ill-fated town that was stricken by the earthquake in 1851, when over 1,000 of its inhabitants perished. It now has the appearance of a great military encampment set up in a bombarded town. More than 3,000 tents have provided shelter for the homeless. The frightfulness of it all is difficult for us in Britain to fully realise. Nobody has a good word for British weather. We grumble at our fogs, we even grouse at rain in July.